Hello Internet, my name is Aaron Garcia, and this is a cheap projector from Amazon. I picked this up on Amazon uh, for a Christmas, actually New Year's party that we're going to have here pretty soon, New Year's Eve, planning ahead. And uh, we want to watch something outside, and I didn't want to spend too much on it. I got this and the projector screen for, believe it or not, $271 after tax, which is pretty impressive. So this was about $75. This I have no idea, but it was $100 off and $10 off, and uh, $15 actually. So, and it was already on sale as, on top of that. So, we're gonna see if we, what we think of it. My buddy uh, says that I should have gotten an Epson, but Epson projectors cost $3,000, and I didn't want to do that. So, we got this one, and uh, it says it's a 1080p video projector. It can support 4K, which is good because a lot of stuff is 4K now, but it's a 1080. And it says it's, uh, doesn't say very much actually on the, on the packaging. If I show you the packaging there, it doesn't say a whole lot. It just says the resolution, the power supply, dimensions. And what I know about it is you can get it to uh, display up to 400 inches. So this projector screen is 100 inches and uh, we don't need it to be very big, and I don't necessarily need it to be very bright. We just want it in the background. So let's see what we got here. Open it up and see what we think of it. So when I open the box, I am greeted with a bag, and it has the company's name on it. I think I'm pronouncing that. Sobe, Sov, Sov Boy, Sov Boy. All right, you can say uh, if I'm pronouncing that right in the comment section, but uh, looks good, comes in the bag. Kind of reminds me of a lunchbox for some reason. So it's a really compact projector. And look at that, it's all there. Everything you could want is right here. Strapped in, nice and snug. I'm gonna unstrap it, take a look. Dust it off. It's bagged really well. Oh, I'm just so excited. So, here's your projector. Got a lens cover on it right now. I'm not gonna take it off just yet. We've got our buttons. It looks like a power button, some kind of menu, arrow keys, I guess a back button and a Bluetooth Wi-Fi button, not sure. On the side of the projector, we have a USB port, a headphone jack, a audiovisual plug, I guess so you can put your camera in there, you know, like, We'll, we'll take a look what we've got here. HDMI 1 and 2, another USB plug. Uh, in the back, there's not much going on. It looks like a receiver of some kind. Oops, I just dropped the uh, lens cover. And a power uh, plug. So I was trying to find the ports online and I didn't see them. But now I realize they're on the side and they didn't show a photo of the side, they showed a photo of the back. And this is what the uh, lens in the front looks like. And you got a little switch, you know, I guess so. Uh, turn knob so you can zoom in and out. Um, so we're gonna see what that what that's like. Put that back on for now. And let's look at the wires. So it comes with a bunch of cables, which is nice because you need them. And a remote. Oh, look at that. You got a remote. And uh, I don't see that it comes with any batteries because I can. I feel that it's light. It's uh, two AAA batteries. We're gonna take care of that. And I've got an HDMI cable, good. And I've got a power cable, definitely need that. And this is that audio visual that I'm talking about. Oh, this is the component, uh, red, white, and yellow. It's been a long time since I've seen these. I haven't seen that in a long time. Uh, so let's go ahead and power this on. I'm gonna do this inside first, just to get an idea for what exactly we need to do. Okay, cut it. Okay, so we're putting in the batteries. All right, so new batteries. Okay, try not to break my new projector here. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Like, I feel like uh, it doesn't want to like close properly. Oh my gosh. I don't think we've had this much trouble for. Uh, I think I broke it. Oh, 
What was that thought? Yeah, I'm good with it. Already. Or no. No, no. Or no. Yeah. Okay. Hope I don't have to change those batteries in a long time. Now it's set up properly. Okay, next. Power button. Power cord. Yes, power. We need power. Find somewhere to plug this thing into. So this bad boy uh, is gonna get plugged into, I don't know, over here. And we're gonna turn dark to like project onto. And we test this out. Yeah, we're gonna need something to project with. Uh, we're gonna, ah, we'll go over here. Okay, perfect. So we're gonna turn off some lights. We, we don't need those. And we're gonna project somewhere random. Okay, you can see I didn't plan this out. All right, so we got it plugged in. Gonna turn on the power button. It's now powering on. You're greeted with Sovi. Sovi something for everyone. Ah, it's fine. It's loading something. It's actually quite bright. I think it's actually really bright. I'm gonna turn off the light behind it so we can actually see it better. So I got it set up. Uh, we have a uh, projector screen that we can put it on. But right now I'm trying it on the flex. It's actually working really great outside. Uh, it's really bright. Uh, one thing I did notice, it smells a little bit like smoke. A little bit, kind of the plastic kind of getting uh, settled in. But now that we're outside, it's, it's, it's pretty good. It's very bright. And it looks good. I can put it anywhere. In fact, I could put this on the house. We make a very nice screen, as you can see. It looks really good. It looks very good. So I'm very impressed with it. And I think this is a great buy if you're looking for a cheap Amazon projector, uh, something for, for the New Year's, something for barbecues, something for Super Bowl Sunday. Perfect for that. Well, that concludes my video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button and subscribe for more videos.